okay, I'm rambling too much. Let me go straight to the point. Now, here I have a bowl of lime orange. You may need something like this or much more, depending on the kind of body odor that you have. Like I said before, I've recommended them to people and it has worked so much well. You just need one at a time. Yes. You just cut into two. My knife. I'm battling with it. It's not that sharp, you understand? You say this. You cut it. Hello everyone, welcome back to my station. Welcome to the gym network. I am Uke God. Welcome to Afaibo State. Afa Basibo State. Okay, if you are new and you are seeing my face for the first time, you are welcome. Just help me quickly click on that subscribe button and you are part of this family. So from the topic you would have seen what I'm about to discuss. It is a very sensitive issue that a lot of people who are going through it don't even know they have it. Talking of body odor, stenchy body odor. Hmm. Somebody like me, I can't even stand it. If I sit close to someone that has this body odor, I, I may not be able to show it to the person, but if that person is sensitive, you will notice that I will just gradually walk away from you and that is it. That is it with those that have it. There are people that it is their sister, their mother, their father, their friend. And they find it difficult to like tell them. How am I going to tell them? Okay, there is a common saying that you want to tell somebody that your mouth smells. But you don't want it to be offensive. How do you do it? Simple. Just buy toothbrush and toothpaste. Give it as a gift to the person. And the person will be fine. Do you understand? And when it has to do with body odor, a lot of people will tell you, oh, use deodorant, or oh, use body spray, or oh, use perfume. Those things doesn't work if you have a stenchy body odor. There is no way you're going to use perfume, deodorant, or body spray that it will go down. It will rather increase it. So that is why I am here to tell you about the lime orange. Mm -hmm. You know about it. This is a remedy I have used to control or to help a lot of people to eliminate, total elimination of their body odor. And that is why I say, wow, I have a family here. I should let you know about that. So that there is a way you can at least talk to those ones that have it. I mean, what is this body odor? I'm not talking about the natural odor that we are born with, you know? Sometimes when you are very busy, you perceive it. That is very natural. I'm talking about the other, an unpleasant smell that comes out from anybody, be a male, female, and all of that. But it's very, very what? Unpleasant. It is so stenchy to the point that there are people that when they go into a particular room or hall and they are out, you go into that same place. You will know that such a person have come into that place. I used to have a cousin like that, a far distance cousin. If I go into a particular place she has visited and she had gone out, as soon as I step into that room, I know that hmm, she was here. And to confirm my thoughts, I will ask, was so, so, so and so person here? say yes. Do you understand what I mean? It is that bad. A lot of people, some people say, persons are born with body odor. It's not true. Some people say that after giving back to a child and that child is not paid, properly baited, the body order will come. Okay, that might be true. That brings me to the point of what causes body order. Human practices. When you have people that are so dirty, I mean, you wear a cloth, for instance. You see this cloth as beautiful as it is. As soon as I'm done with it, the best thing I'm supposed to do is to air it, either under the sun, or a place that is very spacious for air to pass through. If I am going to use it without washing it, which I'm not really comfortable, repeating a particular cloth after wearing it. But a lot of people enjoy it. They will wear that cloth for like three, four times, including adults. And these practices, they start it from the age of 13, 14, 15. Do you understand? From the teenage age. 
and they are used to deal with any character, any habit you are known with, and that habit didn't leave you up until 18 years, it will be difficult for you to let go. Yes, it will take a special training and teaching for you to change. Okay, I'm rambling too much. Let me go straight to the point. Now, here I have a bowl of lime orange. You may need something like this or much more, depending on the kind of body oil that you have. Like I said before, I've recommended them to people and it has worked so much well. If you have a stenchy body odor, please do away with um, body spray and all of that and make use of this. How do we use it? You go into the bathroom, if you are the type that bath like twice a week, um, a day, there are some women, 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 I need to talk to you guys, you get. We have a lot of things we need to wash. And it's so much unpleasant that a lot of us rush into the bathroom, just pour water and we rush out. Where are you rushing to? And by the time you sit close to somebody, you have painted your face, you are, you know, with your cortex and everything. But nobody can stand your smell. That is very terrible. Take your time to birth. There are places you need to scrub. Scrub them very well. Places, you know, under here, you understand? A lot of you have hairs there. I don't know, maybe you are leaving it to apply relaxer so that they think, I don't know, why do you leave them there and you won't even wash them properly? Why? All of these things will just, hmm. When you sit close to somebody, you smell, there is this hotness that comes with your breath and your presence. It's not good. Your friends may not tell you, your mom will not tell you, your husband may not even tell you because when you begin to stay with somebody or some persons in a particular house, they will get used to that your smell that they may not even want to tell you. Do you understand? And it will be an embarrassment. Okay, when you go into the bathroom, you just need one at a time. Yes, you just cut into two. My knife, I'm battling with it. It's not that sharp, you understand? You see this, you cut it. You might as well cut the line open before you go into the bathroom. And by the time, you get into the bathroom without even applying water. Take up one of your armpits and scrub. You know what it means to scrub? Scrub it very seriously. One for each armpit. Use this one again for this. And leave it there. You continue bathing. Use soap for other parts of the body. By the time you are done scrubbing your hands, your head and everything, you go back to that place, you wash off. Do this for like one week. Come back and give me the result. You feel very light there. Don't use deodorant, use it for like a month. Then when you have seen the changes, then you go and invest on good deodorant. But if you ask me, I will say, you can use this for a long period of time and you are sure, open up and tell your friends or your family if you smell or what have they noticed. I have recommended one of my students actually I went into that place as a new worker and one of my colleagues was telling me that you see that girl she smells so bad and I noticed it. Now there are mothers that wouldn't want you to caution their children. You understand? They feel that they are the only one that takes care of their children and a lot of things get spoiled. When we are growing up, they say every child is the child that belongs to the community. So everybody is good, is responsible to training you. So I, I said, let me find out the kind of family she come out from. I don't want to talk to a, somebody's child and they will come fighting me, even though I want to help them. So I met with the mother of the girl, because this girl is a teenager. And I asked the woman, this is what I have observed with your daughter. How do she, does she take her bath at home and all of that? The woman opened the door and I loved her kind of person. She said, hmm, auntie. She don't have for. She go wear one cloth for one week. She, she go sell fish. She go sell a, a provision, everything. I go shout, 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 shout. She, it's okay. I'm talking to you because I want to talk to her. As her teacher, I believe she will listen to me. She said, auntie, I beg. God bless you. Anything you want to do with them, I beg. I called this girl. I told her in my exact word. I went to the class and I told her, I said, Come and see me privately during break. Nobody will know what I want to talk to her about. Because she also has self-esteem. 
she came to me and asked. And I told her, I said, do you know you smell? I didn't hide it. I said, you like, you smell, do you know? She said, no, she doesn't know. And I spoke to her. I told her, I've spoken with your mother and that's the reason I'm telling you. So many staff know that you smell, but they can't tell you. But I'm not like that. So I'm telling you, how do you use your clothes? What kind of soap do you use? She says she uses every kind of soap, any soap she sees. Ah, it's no good. If it is Lux, if it is uh, Joy, whatever, but just be consistent with one or two soaps. In case you can't find this, you will find this. Concentrate on one cream or two. In case you can't find this, you'll find this. After talking to her, okay? As soon as you get back from school, use another singlet, wash this one, keep. You have two uniforms, wash. Use the lime orange one week. I told her, go and practice and come back and tell me. One week. Do you know how she came back to tell me? <laughs> it was on a vast day. She went to my locker and dropped beautiful red flower and a write-up telling me, I love you. Thank you so much. And the mother came back to say, God bless you so much. That is one example out of many. You understand? So please go make use of the lime orange and help those people that smell around you to at least tell them. There is a way you will tell them. If you feel that you can't tell them, just buy the lime orange and give to the person and say, ah, I've been using this thing to baffle, honestly. Eh? And they think they work like fire. Go and try it. Come and tell me. The person will not that take offense that you are telling her or him that you smell. Do you understand? So now I'm giving you the tip. What are you waiting for? Come on, take it off. Till I see you in my next vlog.